So I'm inside of the Illustrator and I'm going to create a little bit more detail to my ocean here, to my water. And I'm going to share with you a pretty easy way actually to make waves. Um, so let's just uh, jump right into it. Pun intended. Into the waves. Okay, <laughs> so I've got my ocean layer here, my water, and what I'm going to do is create a black rectangle just above the water, like so. With that selected, I'm going to go to Effect. Let's see where we have it. Distort and Transform, zigzag. Pretty useful effect, and especially for waves. So let me hit Preview. You can see here it's updated, and it's not quite the way I want it to be, so I'm going to add a little bit more. Add some more ridges per segment down here. And I'm going to make it from corner to smooth. And yeah, so just tweak around the size here and the segments to get something that you know, to get the look that you're going for. So let's try this one out. You can always go back and change that later on, so I'm just going to head OK to that. All right. So now I've got kind of like a wavy rectangle above our water. It doesn't really make any sense as it is right now. Actually, it looks a little bit scary. But uh, okay, I'm going to select this and I'm going to clip it, like copy it and delete it. And I'm going to select my water, and then I'm going to the transparency dialog open here, the palette open here. I'm going to double click this blank area, which is going to make a transparency mask. And once I've double clicked it, it is active. And now I have my weird looking black wavy shapes uh, in my pasteboard, so all I gotta do now is click paste in place. So I'm gonna hit Shift Command V, which will place, you know, paste it uh, in the same position that it was before. And, you know, all I gotta do now is move it down a little bit. I'm going to zoom in, and as you can see, it is now working as a mask, masking away. Uh, you know the area that it that it's in because it's black and black hides in a mask so I'm going to find the edge here see there we have it maybe right about there and go back you know click in the left square of the mask to get back to normal drawing mode and zoom out and see you like what you just did. And I think they're a little bit, maybe a little bit too rough, these waves are a little bit too large, but you get the general idea, I hope. So yeah, that's basically it. Play around with it, have fun. And don't forget to enjoy the real ocean. All right, cheers.